So for this assignment, I have decided to show teenagers, people my age, what to do in the valley when there's literally nothing left to do. And the only places we go to is to eat, we go to movies, and downtown. Over the course of from today to the time this assignment is due, I'm going to show you some fun things you can do with your friends. I promise you, it is fun, it is enjoyable. These are personal things that I've done with my friends that we continue to do and we have a lot of fun with. So yeah, just keep watching. So one of my favorite places to go to is Moonbeans. I always go here either by myself or with my friends. And I always go there to either catch up on some work or just hang out. And overall, I think it's a super cool place. They play super chill music. I love the environment. I always feel relaxed and I always feel like I can get some work done. So yeah, I highly recommend this place. I literally come here like three times a week. And these clips are just to show you how often I do come here, which is a lot actually. So yeah. So today we're going to be painting or you know, putting clay together. Hands in Art Studio was a super cool experience for me personally. I like being creative, so I had fun with this. If you like arts and crafts and all that jazz, then I would really recommend it. It can be a little pricey, but they do offer different events and different price ranges. There are other places like this, like Tipsy Canvas, but overall we had a really good experience. I know everyone pretty much knows about bowling here in the valley, but I just wanted to quickly say that on Fridays and Saturdays, they have three hour, $15 unlimited bowling. And they turn off the lights, they put the music super loud, play some really cool throwbacks and new songs. And overall, it was a super good time. I went with my family and my friends, and we really had a good time that night. Something I really love to do is cook either by myself or with my friends. We always laugh, have a good time while we're cooking, and at the end we get to enjoy it together. And I really recommend you guys doing this with your friends or with your family or even by yourself. It's super cool to learn new things and to try out new things. So yeah, I really recommend it to everyone. It's just really cool. It's a cool thing to know how to do. This clip's really small, but I just wanted to quickly say to support your local restaurant businesses and you never know, you might find a new place you'll go to all the time. So yeah, just wanted to say that. Something I really like to do is buy plants, either herbs or flowers or succulents. And it's just something I find really appealing to see and I like to use it when I'm cooking so it's a really inexpensive hobby to do and I really enjoy it. So Ibra and I decided to paint this day. Painting isn't something I do all the time and we found ourselves being there for hours just painting and just really having fun with it decided to join me at the farmers market at the McAllen Public Library which is held every Saturday from 10 to 1 p.m. There's valley growers who sell their own produce here, organic foods, honey, you know stuff of that sort and we left with our bags full and it was a super cool experience. I've never been and I would definitely go again.
So as you guys know, the convention center is always hosting all these big events. And this is Sunset Live. It's held every second Saturday of the month from April to June and October to December. And it's completely free. There is vendors from all over the Rio Grande Valley and food trucks. And this day we went to see one of our friends perform. So this past Friday, my mom and I went to the Las Palmas Race Park and there they have racing and they hold um, certain events and this day there was a big crawfish boil. They hold this event every year and it's a super popular event. They have live music, unlimited crawfish, unlimited drinks, literally ate our hearts out. Seafood is my favorite food in the world right now. So I really had a good time and since this is a last clip, I lastly want to say that I will have all the links in the description to the places I didn't get to go to and these places as well. And if you guys have any other locations you would like to let people know about, make sure to leave it in the comments and I will too. Thanks.